Is it burpees? Is it sprinting? Is it doing jogging? What up guys, it's your boy Matty and in this video I'm going to be addressing the question the best exercise for fat loss. I shouldn't do that when I've got a hoodie on because you annoying. Anyway, if you're watching this on YouTube, I suggest you hit that subscribe button and that bell button to get notified every time I drop new contents, new videos. But let's get into this question because it comes up a lot on forums, on Instagram, on the social medias, on the YouTubes, on the interwebs. And it's like, what is the best exercise for fat loss? You know, is it burpees? Is it sprinting? Is it doing jogging? Is it running? We all want to find out the one hack, right? The quick way to shed fat, get lean, feel sexy and you know, just feel good, get the gold confidence back. And the bottom line is, unfortunately, there is no one best exercise for fat loss, okay? There's no one best thing to do. Like, yes, if you just do uphill running or if you just do burpees, you're going to burn fat more. The approach needs to be zoomed out a bit and not so like, you know, mm, is it just that one exercise? We need to have a good nutritional approach and a good training program. And that's going to be tracking your calories and macros in a calorie deficit and doing resistance training. And that is the opposite of what the social narrative tells you. Most people think tons of cardio, burn calories, burn calories, burn calories, get on the treadmill, elliptical, do HIIT training, go to body pump classes, right? Calories, calories, calories burning. What happens when you do too much cardio and you don't address your nutrition properly is you end up skinny fat, which I don't think anyone watching this video wants because you're not taking enough protein, you're taxing your central nervous system too much, doing loads of cardio, and you end up wasting lean muscle mass. No one watching this needs to lose muscle mass, okay? We need to maintain muscle mass, lean tissue, and strip body fat, and therefore that equals a lean, a sexy, a nice, attractive physique for guys and girls. So that nutritional approach, calories and macros in a deficit with resistance training. What is resistance training? It is weight training. It is putting our muscles through resistance. In fact, it doesn't even need to involve weights. If you're a beginner, I'd say start with body weight. You can do then progress to light weights, dumbbells, and then barbells. As you get stronger, obviously increase the weight. That's called progressive overload. And we want to keep strengthening and stressing our muscles in the correct way but there's still tons of ways to do resistance training you can do trx you can do resistance bands you can do kettlebells there's loads of ways to put your muscles through resistance but if you're doing a calorie deficit if you're hitting a calorie deficit with a limit of protein and you're doing resistance training on a regular basis three to four times a week you're going to get amazing results that should be the approach you're going after okay there's not one best exercise for fat loss and if you're going at that if you're approaching that with that mindset where it's tons of cardio I, i've got to feel absolutely knackered and smashed after you know a hit session or a long cardio session you're going to be spinning your wheels, no pun intended, but there is a pun there. You need to address the proper way. Calories, macros, strength training, resistance training, and cardio can be a supplement to your training, but there is no one mode or one best exercise to burn fat. That being said, that being said, you want to pick a mode of exercise that you enjoy. So if you enjoy playing sports and you, you can see yourself doing that for the foreseeable future for months, weeks, years, or whatever, you should be doing that. I'd also suggest adding in at least two resistance-based sessions a week, but pick a mode of exercise that you can continue onwards. Guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Leave in the comments below what's your favorite exercise, what's got you results in weight loss, in fat loss, and until next time, I'll see you then.